The paper exam era is ending. Here are five key things you need to know about the new digital AP tests. Hey, I'm Melanie Kane from the Absolute Recap, and I make AP Bio easier with podcasts, study guides, videos, and the ultimate review packet. If you're taking an AP exam in 2025, you need to know about some big changes coming your way. Starting this May, 28 AP exams will shift to a digital format through the Blue Book Testing app, which works on Mac, Windows, iPads with keyboard attachments, and school-managed Chromebooks. The goal is to enhance the security and efficiency of AP exams. The only students still using paper exams will be those approved for specific accommodations. There are two types of digital exams, fully digital and hybrid digital. In fully digital exams, everything happens in Blue Book, both multiple choice and free response sections. Your answers are submitted automatically when time's up. For hybrid digital exams, you'll answer multiple choice questions in Blue Book, but free response answers are handwritten in paper booklets, which are returned for scoring. The AP subjects impacted by the digital transition include major courses like AP World History, AP U.S. History, AP Computer Science, and AP Environmental Science. Hybrid digital exams include subjects like AP Biology, AP Chemistry, AP Calculus, AB, and AP Physics. It's crucial to know what type of exam format your AP subject will follow so you can practice correctly and come prepared on test day. I'm not saying that I predicted the future, but the AP Biology testing practice available in the Ultima Review Packet already follows a hybrid format. Multiple choice questions are all digital, while well, FRQs are viewed digitally, but there is a printable booklet to handwrite your answers and graph. You can view these resources by signing up for a free preview of the Ultimate Review Packet at the link below. You might have already experienced the Blue Book app if you've taken the digital standardized tests like the SAT. Blue Book offers several tools to make testing easier, including highlighting and annotating text, eliminating answer choices, marking questions to return to later, embedded reference materials such as the periodic table and equation sheets, and just announced this week, Blue Book will feature a Desmos graphing calculator. Plus, you'll have scratch paper for planning and outlining, and you can still use an improved physical calculator instead. Don't worry, there's plenty of time to get familiar with the app. You can practice in AP Classroom, preview the test format, and even watch video tours of Blue Book's features. No need to stress about internet issues. Blue Book only needs a connection at the start and end of the exam. If your Wi-Fi drops out, testing continues without disruption. Even if the internet is down at the end, you'll have up to four days to find a connection and submit your encrypted responses. So you're covered. To recap, the transition to digital AP exams may seem like a big change, but with the right preparation, you'll be ready to tackle it with confidence. Be sure to stay updated with your AP teachers and the College Board. And as new information is released this school year, I'll be updating here on this channel too. If you have any questions about the digital AP testing or preparation tips you'd like to share, please comment below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next recap.